Hi Sagittarius, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your reading for November 4th through 11th. So remember the timing is fluid, so whenever it resonates. And this reading is not a private reading, okay? It's not just for you. It may be yours, it may not be. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Typically, I focus on love, but we all know sometimes that don't come up, so we'll see what happens. Oh, you need to have faith, huh? Believe in yourself. This is seeking guidance, perhaps. Ooh, ooh. we have a tower reversed. Somebody may have made the wrong judgment call or there was some sort of lie or deception here. Or even it could just be lack of awareness, okay? This right here is listen to your inner guide. Your inner guide is telling you something. This is not listening, seriously. You may not be aware of something and you need to listen at this time. Somebody may be telling you something and you're missing it. Okay? Pay attention to the signs at this time. Because it looks like you're being guided in some direction. You're receiving some guidance, whether it's from somebody on this earthly plane or somebody from the other side. Because this card can sign signify somebody from the other side. Wh whoever it's from, you need to really pay attention at this time. Because you're receiving something, but you're not aware of it. Let me just get some more cards here. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> Yikes. So, you know, I know there's some people that only want to hear butterflies and rainbows, and I'm sorry that i got to bring this up, but I can tell you right now, this is not going to be butterflies and rainbows. So if that's all you can hear, I suggest you tune out at this very moment. Because it's not butterflies and rainbows this week. Okay? You may be dealing with another woman who is jealous and vindictive. Or a woman. This is a female. Okay? This could even be you. I mean, you... Could be if you are a woman, you could be taking on this energy where you're upset. Somebody is upset in this situation. Looks to me like it's a female. All right. And it, there could have been a third party situation. I mean, come on now. We have the three of cups reverse, right? And then this ace of cups reverse. This is not emotionally fulfilling. And I've been sacrificing myself for what? Somebody lacks self-respect, self-esteem, self-confidence. But it looks like you guys are going to come out of this. You're going to come out of this on fire, okay? You are. You're going to find that fire within to stand up for yourself by the looks of things. And you're going to feel relief. Either there's going to be some sort of relief that comes out of this. Whatever conflict that you're going through is going to probably make you find some strength. And it may just relight that fire within you. If your fire has been dimmed, it looks to me like in the near future it's going gonna, it's gonna to be lit right back up. Okay, so... Be prepared for a passionate new beginning, all right? That's what this card is. It is going to happen. It's going to happen. But to get to this passionate new beginning, I mean, this is a really, I mean, this is a positive card, and this is a positive card, and you could say these two are kind of positive in the reverse. Other than that, you've got something to deal with to get to this passionate new opportunity, whatever it is. You do. you got something to go through, and... 
part of this, whatever it is that you have to go through, is really about listening. Because the Hierophant is a teacher. And that's the very first card that came out. Somebody has something to teach you. Or it was a lesson to be learned, whatever you've gone through. And you need to wake up and, and see it. And you and, and you, you got to see what's mirroring that hair off. Somebody doesn't see it. They don't see the lesson in the situation, whatever it is. Now, the five of pentacles is often a victim mentality. It's reversed. You're not a victim. You have the strength and the power to break free of whatever it is that's holding you back at any time. Okay? You do. You have, the, you have it within you to deal with competition, to deal with competitors, to remove yourself from petty drama. You have the power. You have the strength. You have that force within you. All you have to do is find it. And, you know, whatever's going on is changing your life in a big way. Your life is about to change in a big way. And you're about to have a passionate new beginning. And you might be like, where does it say my life is going to change in a big way? Five, five, five. Okay. All in the same lineup. Five, five, five. Major life choices, major life changes. Your life is about to change in a big way. You, and right now, you may be struggling because maybe it just hasn't happened yet. The breakdown, the true breakdown that pushes you in that new direction, maybe the, the climax of it all hasn't happened yet. Yeah, it's been rough. I know that it has. And you may feel like you, you can't take it much longer. You may feel weak, you know. But, but, whenever this does finally break down, it's going to bring you a passionate new beginning. And it's like you're going to feel instant relief. The five of wands reversed is relief. Instant, almost. Okay, instant relief. So... Right now, though, it looks like there is a woman. If you're a woman watching this or you're a man, there's a woman that here that is a little bitter and upset. Not happy at all. Okay? Definitely not. And it's because of her partner. Okay? Now, neither one of these people are happy. They aren't. They're not happy. They're both upset. They're both um, trying to be in control. Both trying to be the authoritative in the coupling. I'm the one in authority. No, I'm the one. I'm the one that's in control. No, I'm the one that's in control. And whether you're saying those words or not, it's like there's a power struggle here between a man and a woman that is really... Nothing to celebrate, okay? It really isn't. And it's almost like they're bullying back and forth. Verbal abuse. So, I mean, there could be some verbal abuse going between it in both directions, okay? This ain't a one-sided situation. Both people, in the man and the woman are saying things that they are probably going to regret. Or maybe they won't because there's, there's lack of remorse here. So maybe they don't have any remorse. I don't know. But there's definitely some fighting going on. Absolutely. You could be dealing with an air sign for sure. Aries, Leo, or uh, well, I said Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So we'll go with that. Air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. You also have Scorpio. You also have Taurus. I already said Leo, if Scorpio again. Either way, we also, I mean, for some of you, this won't resonate with all of you. For some of you, there's a man here that has cheated and had sex with somebody else. I don't know who that's for. And this woman is pissed. 
So you're going to look and see what's here. This man, three of cups reversed with this, this ace of what has, you know, played with somebody else. And now she she's like, that's not love. Oh, jeez. Um, come on now. All right. Well, that sums it right up, doesn't it? So, yeah, there's a new, there's a, like I said, expect the, the, the 555. I don't even know if I got into that yet. Expect the unexpected. 555. There's, there's shit that is changing and it's changing for the better. But before you get to that better, you're going to have to find the strength to deal with it, to deal with the fight. Okay. There is definitely a fight going on that's making, bringing somebody down. Somebody's going to need to defend themselves, but there's a better suitor. And you notice where I put this card. You never know where I'm going to put the cards, and I love to do it that way. There's a better suitor for both people, for both people involved. And this is somebody that you don't expect. It's not your usual type, but all of a sudden there's that instant connection. That's what's coming. That's what's coming in the future. And it, or it's happened already, okay? There's there, and, it, and even the woman could have done this. Maybe they both did. You, this is so many different people in the world. Somebody is finding somebody else that they are better suited for, and it leads to to love, okay? Somebody in this dynamic hasn't put a, been putting in effort. They haven't been trying hard enough, and now it looks as though. Somebody's about to make a final decision. A decision is about to be. This is a decision. I'm serious. I'm about to make this decision to do the right thing. To be honest with myself and everybody else about this situation. This is honesty. This is an act with integrity. This is also a card of karma. It's about doing the just thing. There's, there could also be some legal issues that come out of this. This could end up in court. Somebody's getting thrown out by the looks of things. Somebody could end up getting thrown out. See, he's thrown out. And it ends up in court because somebody, you know, take a look at this. I mean, they, they you know found their passion elsewhere and if you are single and you haven't met somebody you could meet somebody you could and there's a strong magnetic attraction that you can't deny Woo! yep queen of cups it's about love right it's about my heart it's about what my heart deserves somebody is offering you love they are it's your justice it's what you deserve at this time you deserve you deserve to be loved you deserve to be treated with integrity you deserve to be treated fairly i think that somebody is getting thrown out or they're <laughs> getting caught naked see he's even naked it's like somebody jumped out of the fucking window naked or they got thrown out. Somebody got caught by the looks of things, okay? Somebody got caught naked and now the shit has hit the fan and it could end up in court. Whatever this is, it's going to be a it's going to be a, a balancing act, okay? You're going to have to make a decision as to how you want to handle this, what it's going to cost you, what you're going to do, what you need to give up, you know, if what compromises you need to make. You know, I think that there's definitely a choice between two options and you're probably going to have to let one of them go, whatever these options are. And perhaps you're dealing with somebody who's been juggling two options and now the truth comes out. Somebody, There's been a lack of truth here. And remember, I said there's something you haven't been seeing. So there's definitely something going on behind the scenes here. Absolutely. But change is on the on in the air. Change is in the air. Okay. 
Things are going to happen very quickly, especially with 555. That When 555 comes out, was in the Daily Read this morning, it's because you need to let go of the old to bring in the new. And I do see a passionate new beginning here coming for you. You've held on to something that was unstable for a while. You don't make a move. The universe does it for you. Somebody's getting caught by the looks of things. Caught with the pants down. I mean, come on now. There's a lot of sexual energy here. And I think this has, is leading somebody in a new direction. Somebody has been refraining, keeping it, keeping it to themselves. But their intuition and their inner guide is telling them where they need to go. Their intuition is inner guide and inner guide, whoever this is for, is saying, follow your heart, follow your heart, follow your heart, follow your heart. Yeah, there's a new opportunity. There's a new opportunity that's going to put you basically on reset. Starting at the very beginning of a new journey. Seriously, the Page of Pentacles, he's just about to start a new chapter, or a new phase, or a new job, or something. He's starting at zero, basically. He's got a lot to learn. He's starting new. He's, he's going down a new path. And he's willing to learn along the way. And I think that you're about to go down a new path that is going to teach you some new things. I remember we talked about that teacher. You're going to learn some new things, but when it's going to lead you towards love. It is. Whatever is happening, it's, it's, it's heading. This is movement towards love. Okay? Movement towards love. So you're headed towards a, you know, I think it's like a, a perfect match. I was going to say divine connection, but it is. And there's going to be a lot of passion. But you need to allow it instead of trying to. And you know, people are like, oh no, I can't allow it. I can't allow it. Well, this looks like you need to, you need to take action. You know, you're not, you're thinking about something too much instead of taking action. And you need to stand up for yourself. You need to put yourself on the top again. So Sagittarius, I feel as though you have a new opportunity, a new passionate beginning being handed to you. I think that before this passionate, or somebody is getting caught with their pants down as well, and there's, they're being thrown out, and it's leading both people in a new direction. That's what it looks like to me. If there's been some arguments, somebody's going to get caught, and it's going to be the end, but it's going to lead them down a new path towards love. A perfect, perfect, perfect match. You guys have been in a period of darkness. Not anymore. You're coming out of this period. You're, 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 the sun is about to start shining again for you. Quickly. Quickly, but you're gonna face some storm first. Okay, you are. There's gonna be there's, or maybe you've already faced it. If you if you've already caught this person and they've been thrown out, well, then your person should be coming very very quickly. There is a new offer of love here that has a lot of room for fertility and growth and happiness. So. Expect the unexpected with that 555. Five, five. Whatever is happening is happening to, let, to move you in the direction that you need to go in. Trust me, that's what 555 five is. It helps you to release the old. But that tower up there, it, I don't care if it's reversed or not, somebody is experiencing or they're going to experience or they have already experienced a... Whew, shake up in their life codependency addictions are affecting your romantic life however that resonates with you maybe it's a sexual addiction could be alcohol as well or drugs oh my god 
deception. Someone is wearing a false self mask. They're absolute. Both people are. Both people are lying to each other. I already told you that. Both people are headed in a new direction. You deserve love. You are lovable. Remember? You are going to get what you deserve when you find the strength to put yourself on top to defend yourself. That's where you need the strength. So, Sagittarius, this is what I have for you. I'll talk to you next week.